Anyone can use Figma Make to create a basic prototype, but those who use this five-part prompting checklist will always get better results. First is the task. What are you trying to make? And you can either prompt this or attach a Figma frame as reference. Second is context. Where is this specific flow or screen fitting in the entire user flow? And you need to be very specific about what you're trying to create. Third are your key design elements. All the important features that Figma Make should incorporate. Operate. Fourth will be the expected behavior of your app. What happens to each and every element when a user clicks it? Fifth will be constraints. You need to specify what device platform is this for or mention a specific visual style or a library. When you're done with these steps, here are the most important things that you need to know about. Always check its mobile preview to make sure that it's properly responsive. If you want to go back to a previous version or a previous code edit, you can always do that by clicking the variant in the chat conversation. Now, all of these five things put together will help you get the best results on Figma Make. In fact, you can use the code Make with Anch 30 for 30 days trial on Figma Make. In fact, you can scan this QR code and get a free course on Figma Make in English and Hindi.